hey guys today is what day is it it is friday february 16th i am just in the bathroom right now i'm about to get ready i'm in washington dc getting ready to go to a wedding so that is the travel vlog welcome to the travel vlog guys i told you we were be traveling so i'm starting today because honestly wednesday and thursday i was exhausted and i did not feel like filming at all I physically couldn't um, we drove here to Washington so it was kind of a long stretch but it didn't feel long but we still drove like nine hours and checked into our hotel and just passed out and been passed out since so I am about to get ready really fast and I promise I will come back on here and film for you guys so watch the transformation and I will see you guys soon we made it to the wedding it hasn't started yet though but <laughs> we're here everyone is here outside it's kind of hot but we'll be inside in a minute for the reception I'll try to show you guys my whole outfit once we get inside <laughs> Too late. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, well, where are we going? Because we can't stand in the way. In the background. We're in the background. See, look at. Okay. This guy done taking pictures. Oh, my juice is in the car. It's probably hot. I left it in the car. It's probably hot. We got up, but we just got done taking pictures. Wait, you want to show me? Oh, I thought that was big. <laughs> this is Bae's outfit. His shoes. 
Matching your dress, show your dress to Matching, matching, matching. Mm -hmm. Handsome, handsome. <laughs> it was a beautiful ceremony. I low key almost cried, y'all. Okay. Gorgeous. Sitting at our table right now. I'm trying to get on Wi Fi because I don't have Wi Fi. I don't have service out here. We're kind of far out in the outer skirts. So, bridal party. Bridal party. Family members, please, please make your way to the back. We'll show you how we do people culture. Please make your way to the back, please. DJ, drop some tunes while we're waiting for them.
guys it is what day is it <laughs> i can't remember today what day is it it is monday it's monday um i believe it's july 19th if i'm not mistaken hold on let me look at my phone because y'all it's been a couple days obviously since things have passed by you guys see that i am home now i think the last clip i showed you i was at the wedding in maryland and i'm already home <laughs> but um trust me it's because i haven't filmed in a couple of days so let me see what time it is it's 4 18 it's 4 18 it is july 19th it's monday um so let me just explain to you guys real quickly we went to maryland um we went to Maryland. We saw a whole bunch of family. Obviously, we went to the wedding. Um, I showed you guys the wedding. Um, it was a traditional and formal Nigerian wedding. I don't know if you guys have ever been to one, but you guys need to go. It's lit. It's such a good time. So, yeah, that's why you saw me in my attire, which some people ask me for the details, but um, I literally had on, um, I'll actually get it because I didn't do laundry yet. So let me show you guys my outfit real quickly. All right, so this is the shirt that I wore from, what did I wear this shirt from? This is from, um, what is that place? Rebellious Fashion. This is from Rebellious Fashion. It's just a one shoulder crop top i always wear this is really stretchy it's really cute and chic i always wear this shirt with everything um i don't know guys like i need to order more colors and more of these because i just have this one that i keep recycling the colors of the wedding were mauve purple and beige so i just wanted to be in the purple family so i felt these pants um they're really big they look like a skirt but they're pants and they have these pockets on the side which I thought was really cute. And then it singes really tight at the waist. See how small the waist is? It singes really tight at the waist. It has this beautiful belt that you can tie. So yeah, I just wore that. And then I wore my Balenciaga bag and my <laughs> Macy in the back right now. And these are my H&M heels that I wear all the time. It's size 38, um, the square toe one. So yeah, I just wore that um, for the wedding. I also had my braids up in like a bun with my coral jewelry, which is like a symbol for um, Nigerian weddings or brides, even though I wasn't the bride, but still like, it's still like traditional um, jewelry. So yeah, that's all I wore. I know someone asked me, so that's just the details on it. It's not your average American um, wedding attire because it wasn't like a, official american wedding it was a nigerian wedding so y'all need to get back to y'all roots because we was not born here <laughs> but anyway <laughs> okay period but um yeah so that's what i wore and um yeah so it was an amazing wedding like it was so beautiful like the bride kept smiling she has such a beautiful smile like she just kept smiling and laughing all night i know she was tired but she just kept like this good energy about her so I'm happy for them um but yeah um i didn't film all that much while we were in dc because um we were around a whole bunch of family some family members haven't seen us in like uh, four years and then other family members we have never met before so i didn't want to bring my camera up in everybody's face like hey you know what i mean plus we went to church wasn't gonna put my camera out then so yeah, um, I didn't film anything really but the wedding because that I knew I could just easily film because everyone else was filming and stuff. But all the other times I just would have felt awkward. So yeah, I didn't really film that much. But yeah, at least I filmed the important part, the wedding. I have laundry back there because I woke up this morning, um, started cleaning like i don't know what it is babe was like you couldn't wait to clean i was like no period i just got to cleaning y'all i cleaned out our entire refrigerator i <laughs> i mopped our floors i bleached everything like i don't know what it is about me but like before we travel and after we travel i have to like deep clean everything i just don't know so i went and deep cleaned everything like let me show you guys the counters and everything is so clean those are mangoes back there um babe's mom got us some mangoes on our way um from our trip 
but yeah i just deep cleaned everything like the floors are super clean everything's like deep clean over there like glaring reflection that's how i know it's clean but um yeah everything's clean this thing is still is wiped down everything i'm even burning my apple candle y'all i'm burning my apple ever after candle from walmart this was six dollars you guys know i bought a whole bunch of them you guys know I, I bought a whole bunch of these so yeah i'm burning that one it smells so good i'm so happy i have the pumpkin one but i'm waiting to burn that um so i have planned today's monday so i just have to get done with laundry like i have a lot of laundry to do i forgot to get um laundry detergent earlier when i ordered like my instacart stuff i forgot to get laundry detergent so when i go out to get prints i'm actually going to get like laundry detergent bathroom tissue and a whole bunch of other stuff that i forgot but yeah oh yeah i even did my pantry y'all like i ordered like some snacks and stuff for the um kids and stuff so i even did like our pantry hold on so I even kind of like straightened up our pantry a little bit as good as it's going to get because y'all this is a real household with real kids, real humans like I can't like 100% make it, you know, patty perfect, <laughs> but it's given what it needs to give. And so I did this too when I came home. So yeah, Prince has his own little, um, Prince has his own little situation in the corner right there. That's all his dog stuff. But yeah, I just straightened this out real quick too. So now for this week, I have to get busy with registering the kids for school because I did not do that yet. I finally got all of the paperwork that I need from the doctor's office. So I'm about to go and register them from, for school this week. I also am gonna take care of um, doing their back to school shopping this week and next week. And I have to decolor the room and use my brand new carpet cleaner. I don't know if you guys seen it, but I am finally going to use my carpet cleaner because I plan on deep cleaning their room. I plan on deep cleaning their room and um, also washing, I mean, cleaning their carpet and stuff. So new carpet cleaner that I have not used. So yeah, I'm about to do that. This is like my room, my terrible room of cleaning stuff but yeah all right i'm at target right now getting the stuff i said i needed um yeah because i need stuff guys bleach hand sanitizing i'm just gonna get two um, I need some tissue paper, y'all. Okay, guys, we're back. We're back. We're back from the stores. It was so rainy out there. Ugh, I hate the rain. <laughs> but um, I'm about to go through this haul really quickly because you guys know I like to do a little little haul for you guys most of the stuff you guys have already seen but I still you know like to show you guys so that you know whatever so I got these stuff with ugh. I got these salad top I got these salad topper southwest out or to your chips I was struggling there uh, I'm about to make a salad so these are so good to add to your salad they're zesty and crunchy and mm, I love these Y'all know I got the up and up disinfectant wipes. I got two of them. I just said, you know what? I, at this point, I need to start going to do Sam's Club because this is, I, I do this every other day. You know, I got my coffee. Can't forget the coffee. I already have one, but I drank like half of it already. So I said, you know what? Let me just get another one. I got some mop pads. Um, you know, when I don't do my deep clean, I for the everyday clean, I use these for the mop. So... Yeah, I got these, some bleach, and some, um, what is this? I got some laundry detergent and then some toilet paper 12-pack because I'd be running out too fast. So, I also got some water, but I already put that up. But, yeah, this is just the overview of what I got. 
okay guys it is the next day i do apologize about the noise because my air is on it's actually on auto but um you know it kind of came on right when we were about to film so i apologize but today is tuesday it is 208 i am in my office right now slash beauty room um i am about to try to organize in here because it's low-key kind of like dirty like i have stuff on the floor i just got done unpacking all of my stuff and i started laundry so um all of my clothes are in the laundry which i'm so thankful you guys for our washer and dryer because i truly remember those days like me doing laundry would take all day because the washing machines were so little or i would go to the laundry mat and spend like forty dollars on laundry because i would be doing so much at a time now i could just go downstairs all of our clothes like my, it seems like i have a lot of laundry but once i fill up our our uh, washing machine it's like i'm done like it's only one load i'm just so thankful so yeah um, um, I'm just happy like that little stuff like that I'd be like so appreciative but um yeah so I am doing laundry right now I just got done unpacking which is why I came up here because I needed to put some of my stuff back so like you guys know in my pack closet I have some stuff up here but I wanted to come up here and put it up so yeah, I just got done doing that. Um, I have a lot of stuff out because I kind of went shopping. So I don't even know where to put it. Like all this stuff is new. I don't know where to put it at. Like I thought I had enough room in my packs closet, but I'm going to have to, I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to have to like really squeeze my shoes I need a sneaker thing like I need a sneaker I need I should have got one more of these these ones I should have got one more of those for my sneakers because I don't know where to put my sneakers like got some Yeezys y'all just got some new Yeezys and I don't know where to put them <laughs> like they're just chilling here but i want to share with you guys a wig that came in this is not sponsored by the way not sponsored i paid for this wig with my own moolah but i wanted to try this wig right here it's by almas almas high life luxury hair um i got it off of amazon you already know your girl began stuff off of amazon i actually was supposed to take out my braids today and do my hair and put on this wig um i was supposed to do that this morning but i didn't feel like it like i had really bad cramps like i'm back in high school like what's going on but um i'll do it later i'll do it later on um later i don't know when i don't feel like doing it probably like later tonight i don't know i just don't feel like doing my hair this is what the back of it looks like and then this is what the front looks like it's very cute um it says high life luxury hair like i said before and I ordered a U-part wig, Body Wave. Um, I have one already, but I wanted another one. And, oh, this is cute. So, it comes with the instructions. You guys know, it always comes with, like, instructions on how to care for the hair. All of the reviews that it's had everything um and then they gave you a stocking cap which i don't need a wig cap but they gave you a wig cap i don't know why they give you a wig cap when it's a you part wig but i already have one i loved my first one from um eunice hair no um what was that wig from it was from i don't know i'll put the name right here once i find out but this wig I particularly wanted because this one actually has clips in it so you guys see the clips that it has it has 
four wig clips. I was trying to look for the other comb, but I guess they don't, they didn't put it on here or maybe it's built like that. There's one comb on this side. There's not a comb on this side, but there's one in the back, of course, with the straps to adjust it. But like I said, the main thing I wanted, of course, and then you, of course, you guys know you cut these strings in the middle, right? But the main thing I wanted is these wig clips. I do better with wig clips more than I do combs. Like, especially for a U-part wig, I don't want combs in my U-part wig. I feel like it doesn't stay down that good. Like I said, my previous U-part wig I loved, but it just didn't feel right with the combs. The wig clips is what I was going for, and it's body wave. So look at the hair. Ooh, it's so bouncy. So cute. So full. So soft. It's an 18 inch. I always wore long weave, and now I kind of like the short look. Like I kind of like bobs. I kind of like short hair and when I have um, wigs or clip-ins or something like that I don't normally go past 18 to 20 inches like I don't go past that I like more of a natural look fall is coming <laughs> I'm sorry to be saying that y'all like Brittany we are still in July it's still very much summer baby but I'm just telling y'all Bath and Body Works Bath and Body Works posted their fall candles so technically it's already fall when they start getting ready. Just saying. But um, because fall is coming, like I said, I want to have shorter hair. I want to have more hair. I can get out of the protective styles with the braids and um, stuff like that. Like I had my hair pretty much braided this whole time like i've been i've been going back and forth with like clippings and stuff like that but wigs and stuff especially a u-part wig i haven't worn a u-part wig uh dang all year like no i haven't worn a u-part wig all year so yeah i'm excited to put this on i'm excited like mm, have some hair girl but yeah i will link this below i have not tried her yet but just based off of the presentation and the reviews and the fact that it has clips, I will link her and recommend for that much. So I found these press-on nails. I think they're so cute. I don't know if you guys can tell the color, but they're like this orangey, nudie color. Um, you guys, you guys probably have seen these in your local like CVS or Walgreens, but I just think they're so cute for fall. Yes, I said it fall, <laughs> but I just think they're so cute because they give this nude color and there's gel like, so they give that shiny coat because I don't like matte nails. I like more of a gel shiny coat, but look at that. I just can't wait to put these on. They're longer than I would, you know, normally like, but still, I can't wait to wear these. Okay, guys, so <laughs> it's obviously later on. Um, getting ready to end the vlog soon. What's that in my yard? Um, you guys, it was so crazy earlier because uh, there was a deer in our backyard. And I know someone asked me before, like, have I ever seen, like, wildlife in our backyard? But I never have before. Like, I've never seen, like, the actual wildlife. Or, I don't know if you consider that wildlife. I don't know, but whatever. I've never seen any, like, deer or anything. I've seen deer um, in, like, the neighborhood and stuff. But never, like, in our actual backyard. And today there was an actual deer in our backyard and of course my kids try to feed it but um it didn't come too close it was like a few feet away um but i did get it on video on my instagram story so i was able to catch it on there but my camera was all the way upstairs and i didn't feel like running upstairs to get it so i couldn't catch it on camera for you guys but yeah there's a there are deers and stuff back here yeah so as y'all can see macy's home she just got home from school i'm cooking her some or heating up some um like dinner lunch type thing because she's always hungry after school but uh, i keep saying but um, and i finished up my laundry 
I am doing the white clothes right now, so that'll be done. I just have to sort the laundry, which is the worst part in my opinion. Like, I don't like sorting the laundry. I don't mind putting it in the washing machine, but I hate sorting it, so I have to do that. Well, it actually looks light out, but it's really dark outside and it's been raining. So all of my patio furniture has been soaked. It hasn't gotten a chance to actually dry. And then my carpet little thing is all messed up because it was storming and it was windy. But I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's really dark outside, gloomy. It's been raining every day. So I just decided that I'm gonna start making dinner now. You guys, I cleaned my, my fridge out. It just looks so much better because it was cluttered and I did not like how it looked. Like I just hated how it looked, but now it's like all nice and clear. Cleaned it out. I was not playing y'all. I think I told you guys that um, earlier, but I didn't think I showed you what it looked like, but I deep cleaned, like I bleached the heck out of this fridge and it felt so good. So you guys, I'm super excited because I got my first like actual like gig as an ambassador. Like this company is paying me monthly and I just feel like, I don't know, I just feel so proud of me because I do not have a management team yet. I don't have a manager yet. So I'm just like growing myself and my Instagram page and my content all on my own. Like, and I'm just proud of me because I'm just like staying consistent, treating it like an a real job because it is a real job you know what I mean and I am seeing results and I'm proud of me man I'm just so proud of me like this is just beginning this is literally just the beginning tip of the iceberg but I'm just proud I'm just proud of me like I'm just proud of me so now that I'm about to now that I got the contract opened up my arm hurts sorry now that I got the contract opened up I'm about to read it through, sign it, send it back, and yeah, get dinner started. So I'll be back after that. Hey guys, all right, so I'm done cooking. I forgot to film. I don't know, I think it was because I was talking on the phone with my mom and stuff, but whatever. We just had some tacos, plain and simple. But it is about 9.43. I'm about to edit this vlog. I am tired. I need to still do my hair tonight. So it's going to be a long night. Yay. But I'm about to quickly edit this vlog, get it out to you guys, and then do my hair, like I said. And tomorrow we have a busy day. I'm going to record, start the weekly vlog tomorrow because it's Wednesday. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for this weekend vlog because my sister and I are going to Bath and Body Works to look at their fall candles and Hobby Lobby look at their fall stuff. So stay tuned for that. You guys know I already went to Hobby Lobby, but I'm going back with my sister this time. But um, what is this doing? Joe, I need to take this arrow. But um, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching my channel. Thank you so much for watching this vlog. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and make sure you click the bell so you'll be alerted when I post a new video. And yeah, guys, I'll see you in my next vlog. Bye.